Teamwork. Believe it or not, in Belgium that's a commercial for public transport. I'm, talk I'm going to talk to you here about de teamwork. I think it was a nice example about teamwork. So teamwork is essential. Teamwork is like the cornerstone of any successful undertaking, right? But teamwork, in fact, is an individual skill. So what does it take to have a well-performing team, a well-performing Scrum team? I'm not talking about Scrum metrics. I'm talking about team dynamics, group dynamics. So how does a, uh, does a well-performing team look like? What kind of ingredients do we need? Well, we need diverse team members. We need diversity of viewpoints. We need to have trust, we need to have openness, transparency, communication. We need to have people that like each other to work together. We need to have ways to manage conflict. We need to have clear objective. We need to have participant leadership. We need to have a positive atmosphere. We need to have engagement. Fuck, that's a lot to do. Right. Um, but then again, like nicely illustrated in this cartoon, if you put a bunch of people together in a group, do you think that something magically will happen and teamwork will occur? No, you need some kind of a spark. Putting a, a group of people together doesn't simply make a team. <laughs> to get to the point of a performing team, so these are the Tuxman stages of group development. If you don't know this, please Google it. It's very interesting. These are different stages that a team needs to get through. Then again, another one, the nine Belbin team roles that exist. So Belbin is basically saying that an effective team needs to have members that cover these nine profiles. And then you can get an effective team. If you don't know this, please Google it. <laughs> uh, let me illustrate a few um, like bad examples that can happen in a team. So you will get to know the true phase of teamwork when things start to go bad, right? When it all goes horribly wrong, then this blaming game might start. But it's important to know that communication inside the team will affect how the team communicates with stakeholders. So, uh, If you have a rotten apple in a basket of apples, what will happen? It will infect all the other apples, the same with a team. If you have like somebody who is negative, it might, it's scientifically proven that it will affect all the team members. So examples of bad team members, or for example, you can have somebody who is a pessimist, a pacific aggressive group eroder, a slacker, an anti-establishment guy, a divide and conquer screen, screen, schemer, or the arrogant fat hat, or the controller, or just yeah, somebody who will fuck up the team. You need to be aware of that. This is called um, groupthink. It happens in a group of people. When everybody thinks alike, well, then actually nobody is thinking. Please be aware of that. Uh, so how can you observe dynamics in a team? How can you explore that? You can listen. Listen how the team is communicating at the daily scrum. Are they being aggressive? Please don't be a scrum zombie. Thanks, Hendrik Nieberg, for this illustration. Be aware of that. So how can we explore team dynamics? We can do some team building. I always recommend the classic scrum. That's me there on the photo in the middle. So that's a good team building exercise. Another one is this that I like and I recommend it. As you see, it's a device with a marker inside and it has some strings to pull. So with a group of people, the assignment is basically that you can draw um, something tangible or intangible, but you observe how the team is communicating and working together because they have to coordinate themselves. And you can change the conditions. You can say that they cannot talk to each other or you blind them or you play loud music and you explore certain roles in the team and team dynamics. And a last thing I recommend is improv theater because working in a team requires improvisation. You can do improv theater exercises. So to finish with this quote, coming together is a beginning, keeping together is a progress, working together is success. Please keep on exploring team dynamics. My name is Frederik Jinkwe Itovicenia.